I'm doing... I'm going to hit recording. Yes, it's recording now. Right, I'm doing a school raid at the new map. So I thought I'd record this. Or at least one of the maps it's taken me to is, um, you know, the Royal Guard score that's been added to the game in the last update. So I thought I'd do school raid with this and learn how it works and I learn where the teleports are. I've noticed while in the event, it's not actually showing you the map to be able to click on and view the teleports anymore. So the video I uploaded that gives you that information for, our, for the other map uh, will be quite handy. I'm not sure if it's going to remove... You see, I'll show you what I mean. You see how you used to be able to... Hang on, can I click there to bring it? No. You can't click on the map to see it. So basically when you enter, if you're on um, the raid team, which is the one where you got to loot from the desks or kill people who have got books or kill the book thieves that you see running around, you'll start off by the teleport. So remember where the teleport is. In this case, it's right here. Or at least that's where one of the teleports are. And I'm looking for book thieves. That isn't a book thief, that's a player. But X bar, as you can see right there, I'm going to see if I can take the book of those. No, X bar looted it first. As you can see right there, you got an um, X-Bar who could kill the book thieves easy or raid the, um, the tables to get the books, but likes to kill other players instead. It's another way of playing the game. You can see this way I've just killed... Um, I'm going there's one. I'm going there's another one. These are book thieves, so these aren't actually players that I've attacked. I can loot them. Or I can take from the desks. Or I can take from here, the desks. Once you've got a book, it'll be attached to your back. Like a book sack thing for carrying books. You then take it back to the teleporter. The yellow arrow... The yellow... Sorry about my tongue tie. Right. The yellow arrow will show you the direction to go to the teleport. Remember, you've really got to be in a high quality or at least medium quality, I believe, in order to see the arrows. And the green ones will take you in towards the desks. Once you've got them and you've gone through the teleporter, you just hand them in as normal to your archive clerk for whatever school you're a part of. I'm Wudang, so it automatically teleports me to the Wudang map. Then you go back to the event, re-enter. You've got five attempts to collect five lots of books to gain some rewards. And these are the rewards for the points you get from killing other players. And anyone within your school that kills players will be stacking up your rewards as well. But I don't normally participate in player killing. I like to let everybody get their books and hand them in. No point being greedy, I say. Uh, I've got this book. So I might as well just take that back in there. The teleport should be round here somewhere because it's where I was teleported in. There's the teleport. There we go. How many attempts have I got left? Two more attempts. And what I like to do is I, I'll do another one. I like to take it down to at least 1% before I start looking around the school to see if I can identify any players that are just going to be going around killing the Lermites. And if I can see them and I'm on the opposite team to them, 
Then I'll attack them for a bit. Switch into this class. There's a few of these. If I take that out for some of the other players, that leaves a few more books on the floor that other players can pick up that they otherwise might not have been able to. If I use this, I can kill him without killing the player. It just helps everybody out, you know what I mean? Instead of being one of those spiteful, nasty and heartless players like many of the players on this game are. That's a book thief. That's something I do like about the Royal Guard class. It does actually make it a little bit more easier with having a pinpoint attack so that you can lock onto a particular player. There are some other classes in the game like priests that have pinpoint attacks like that, like the priest stab grab. But this one, I do like its easy use effect. You know, where you got the pinpoint grab with a chain, or then you got some area damage skills as well. So now we'll take this through. I believe I've got one more attempt. There's 10 minutes left, so I'll have a look around, see what other books I can drop on the floor for other players to be able to pick up so that everyone can complete the event. And see if I can spot any trollers. Players like X Bar X is a troll who likes to just kill people just because they can so they believe they should unfortunately x X is on my team at least she was last so I won't be able to attack her because her name was blue is that that's a player, that's a book thief there. I'm not attacking to a lock on. There we go. And don't worry, I won't attack you. There's someone calling me. Now it's Aaron, as you can probably tell, he's doing the same type of thing. Although sometimes he does go over for attacking players. Yes, as we can see, he's now attacking them ones. Kind of cruel, really. Because he's a high might, their low might. He's attacking them and he really doesn't need to be doing that. It's kind of like he can't pick up a book and take it to the teleport. You know what I mean? That guy had a book he was trying to take to a teleport and Aaron just killed him because he can. That's why it's important to watch my videos on YouTube. You'll learn everything I know and you'll learn how to get strong fairly quick so it would be a lot harder for them to be able to kill you and unfortunately I'm on Aaron's side I'm on the red side so I can't attack him and stop him
There's loads of books and nobody can get them because he's going to kill them as soon as they approach. Tell you what I will do though, I'll let this book thief travel out of here. Turn around, there's some books there anyway, so that's alright. The more books we can drop, the easier it'll be for them. Let's see, is there any book thieves coming down here? We can drop some books at. There's a teleport over there. Like I said, all you need to do is follow the yellow arrows to the teleports. Someone's using a define. Oh, that'll be Aaron. Trying to kill this person. I'm not jumping in to help Aaron there. Because he's attacking them, so... It's not letting me lock on because it's not letting me lock on. There we go. You don't expect me to jump in and help you, Aaron. You are attacking them. You're dead. That book thief is dead. That one's dead. Missed. Come back here. There's a load of books on the ground now, so and they're spread out. So it shouldn't be too difficult for people to sneak in and grab some. I want some book thieves to come over here so we can drop some books down here. As well. Well, I guess I better start grabbing some books, I think. I only need one more, do I? So... There's six, forty, fifty-six. So we've got four minutes. Three minutes. Let's grab a book then. Tell you like there ain't enough of them. It's a pretty cool class, I do like this. It's a shame it's only school class, because I'd like this as like a gold class or something. But I guess you can kind of see why in some of the games, when they, um, they had classes like this called Royal Guard, it was similar to this, it wasn't quite the same. But it was similar to it, where it was like OP compared to the others in what it could do and its damage and everything. I guess you could kind of see why people used to complain about the Royal Guard class. Because it does have some things that give it an edge over other classes. I guess that's why it's called the Royal Guard. School Wars. And the Royal Guard is being attacked. That'll be because people want to get their pages and stuff. I guess. If I open the rewards that I got from participating in that event.
the ones that should be sent into the ma in the mail, I don't think I've received yet. Don't think that'll be sent until a few more minutes, but you get these from a school raid. I should get some more school raid stuff sent in the mail, I think, as well. Six Pass, Winter's Blade, Winter's Blade, Vertigo Dark. These are all the old classes. Some blue ones, though. I ice packed. Uh, da, da, da. Those are all the old stuff. That's not what people are after in that offence, they're after really the Royal Guard pages. But do we actually get any? That's the question for raiding right the school. Because it used to be that you'd get quite a few pages of the school that you ended up raiding. And I didn't choose, you don't choose like what school you're going to raid, you just get teleported to it without choice. It's chaos, no thank you, although I would like to do chaos, how many chaos attempts do I actually have first? Oops, let's go check. Got ten, and you only get two a day. So I won't have wasted any if I don't do it. Let's go to this one. And my school's being attacked as well. So we'll do this one quick raid. This is um this will be the first school wars in Royal going up against Royal Guard, so I have no idea where the flags are or anything. Why am I using that class? I don't know that, yeah. I know Okay, so these are the right guards for teleportation. Right, I'm going to stop there and look for the flag. Right, here's the flag. Right, that's one. So much easier now I can actually participate in the event without like ridiculous lag. I mean, yeah, you still get oops, done a well run around there. Right, where's the boss? Over here, by the south area. I mean, you still get problems with some events like um, World of Minions and stuff. You get invisible wars and stuff. Like rubbish like that. But when it comes to these PvP battles now, it's a hell of a lot smoother. See why they would definitely be angry. The school's only just being added, so they haven't got any high mites in it yet. Because obviously all the all of their school players are uh, new, whereas everybody, all the other schools have been here since day one. I can't go on the defence for this school because unfortunately my school's being attacked. 
for me if I have to finish off in this Sonata room. Sonata of Pain! And fourth, okay. Which means I have to finish off in this school quick so I can get to my school, which is being attacked, and try to defend it. That's probably why they chose to attack my school, so that I can't go on the defense for the other one. I'm going how many... Okay. Looks like you don't just have two battles anymore. You can go on to several schools now. It used to be just two. So once you've completed one, you'd have... Um, Okay, my attack icons are bugged up. Right, that's it. To fix it, you just click on the map at the top right corner and then click a click off it. And uh, you get your attack icons back. So yeah, it looks like... You get... You get to battle several scores. Yeah. So... We'll do this one, see if we can do this quick enough to go and defend Wudang. And obviously more school battles you participate in and get high ranking. The more gold pages and that you can obtain. This flag captured. Not real good. So that's that done. I'll go to the next flag. One more upgrade on my Executioner's Blade. I need 24 pages and then I can get it to Tar 7. And that means I can unlock 15% um, defensive when I use my... Um, 15, no, it's reduced damage by 15% equal to the amount of HP lost. Which obviously would help me out significantly. And you get that by putting um, Xe Blade Special Full Force up to, um, well, Force up to at least um, three. So three points on it, three attribute points or whatever it's called, and you'll get that. I'll show you what I mean at the end of this offense. Use a special while there's not too many enemies here. That way I can keep putting more on it. One more thing I want to do. I think I'm going to stick it back on for this battle. Skill pathfinding. What that means is when I use a skill, it should automatically go back to the last enemy I was attacking or locked on to. Instead of me having to keep running the character to it. Which is good for battles like this, but when it comes to PvP, it's not so good. When, like, you're being fighting in group battles. For this, it's good because you want to be locked onto the mark by the boss and keep.
keep focusing Jay your reckoning. attacks on the boss. But then when it comes to like group battles where it's just players versus players, you want to turn that that I turned on off. Otherwise you'll have a problem if you're constantly going after a player and making you run after them. Well, while you're being attacked by somebody else. Which can be awkward. See, that's auto skill finding when the character automatically runs over to them. And you use an attack. Auto path finding by skill. Something like that to do. Cheese here as well now, which is definitely making a lot of it. Jade Reckoning! Cause she's got ucked. I'm reviving. I don't care. Why? Come on! I hate Oct. Great class to have, not great to fight. Can't get anywhere near the boss. And now I'm just like force locked onto her. I'm trying to get to the boss. Now every time I try, it's just making me attack you. I'm trying to get to the boss. Look at this, the boss is all the way over there and I can't get to it. And now Lucifer's attacking me. He's gonna attack me because he don't like me. That's a waste of my revive. Gee, stop helping Yan. Oh god. Come on, come on, come on. Find the boss. There he is, right the way over there. And because there's so many players around, I can't lock on. You know what? I'm gonna cheat. Let's turn players on screen down to zero. I'm gonna have to revive again, as expected. Has that changed it? Yep, to zero. What that means is I'll be able to see the boss straight off. I'll still be able to know where the other players are. It's still in high quality, but I'll now be able to see the bus. Where is the bus? There's the bus. So much easier. Second, Q Q Q Q beat me. If I didn't get trapped by um Yan and Chi, then for like. I'd say about two, maybe three minutes. I could have got first on that one. What a shame. And the rest, well, my school got defeated. Damn it. I wanted to make it back from my school and go on the defence, but anyways. I guess this will have to be the best I can do for school wars right now. Seven Tai Chi fist somebody. Else. That's because he got rank one in some of his on attack. Oh no, on defense. I think he was on defense for him, or yeah he was. Because he's a high might, he can go on defense, which means you get Tai Chi fist normally from defense. And he can score in high rank so he can get high gold pages. See what I got there. I got two of those martial tokens. Two school books, two more gold school books, two more martial tokens, five of those. It's alright. Every little helps. It's 
playing these. See what I actually got in total then from that. Two Dragon Claw, that's useless, basically. Power Pump, basically useless, I've already nearly maxed that. And Inner Peace. I still need Inner Peace, so that's okay, not completely wasted. It's okay, because I'm still upgrading these. That's junk. I may as well use those. Where are they? It's in this one, ain't it? May as well use this. The tokens that I got because I have a free challenge on there anyway, right now. So I may as well get the free challenge done. Because you get one free challenge a day. So we'll do that now. And then use those tokens and see if we get anything decent. Now, to be honest, normally I just get junk. Way of the fist, that's okay, I guess. At least it's a gold. The rest are probably junk. Firm, that's good. I wonder if that was bound or unbound. It's unbound. I'll get that to cash, because I know he's after firm. I do need firm, but I need so many pages, it'll just take me forever to upgrade. So what I'll do is I'll PM Cash and Shoe and Fabs, see which one of them needs it. I know Cash needs it, and they normally help me out with XC, so might as well give them this, or sell it their place. Okay, so that's that done there. Oh, I don't. I will end this video here because it's dragging on a bit, isn't it? How long has it been? 32 minutes. So that's the new update School Wars and School Raid video. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.